Okay. Now this is a whole different ball game. Hoppla. Yeah. This, this is a uh, a monocle cobra. This is potentially one of the most dangerous snakes you will see anywhere in the world. You can see it's big. It's a heavy bodied snake and it has a very, very potent venom. Right, I'm going to try and take... Oh, that was close. You can see how well Boyle knows the snake, though. He has absolute, complete confidence about how far it can strike. Look what he's doing with his knee. That movement is catching the cobra's eye, and that's what's making it get up and look big and aggressive. Look at him. <laughs> I've actually got a bit of a bead on. I'm sweating a fair bit. Wow. OK, now that might seem like total insanity. But the truth is, this cobra's fangs are on the upper jaw, pointed down like this, and fixed. This snake can only strike coming downwards. So coming down on the top of its head like that, it's actually physically impossible for the cobra to bite Boerly. Even so, that's some serious confidence. Wow. As he turns around to focus on Boerly, you'll see the back of that hood spread wide, and that round center looks like a big eye spot. That is the monocle which gives it its name. It seems ridiculous when you've got a snake as awe-inspiring as the monocle cobra in front of you. There could be something more deadly here, but there genuinely is. There's a snake in this village that could literally eat all these other snakes for breakfast. That's the one that we're trying to find. And it's also the reason why Bua Li King Kopla. has lost some of his fingers.